Okay, Texas Prepper 2 here. Uh, if you do build the greenhouse, you may want to consider a misting system. When you water young plants like this, uh, if you water them with a water hose or even a real gentle sprayer, you can sure do some damage to them. You can beat them down pretty hard. So uh, I've got some misters going right here. You probably can't see it. But it fans out like that and like that. And it covers pretty much two of these trays. You can see they're pretty pretty wet. And uh, so, uh, but it's, it's uh, real simple to do. This is half inch main line. I punched a hole in them and put the misters in them. Uh, if you're gonna punch very many holes, I really recommend this hole punch instead of an all much cleaner hole much nicer job uh, on the end I just kinked it tie wrapped it tie wrapped it across the, pretty much centered it tried to center it uh, where the trays are now I built these shelves these shelves didn't come in the PDF but I built these shelves and just basically put uh, some two by sixes or two by fours uh, all the way across on your uh, horizontal supports and on your bottom frame and you'll need a support in the middle such as that uh, because they will sag in the middle once you get some heavy some uh, plants on here and you water them and they get they get kind of heavy uh, so anyway but simple misting system and what I'll do see if I can get down here without getting the camera too wet uh, right under that shelf I will uh, put a T right there and I'll come out across here to water the bottom shelf. So I'll, I'll split this. I'll have a, a watering uh, uh, my misters up here and I'll come across here and have misters down here. I only had four misters left so uh, I've got to order some more. But these are real nice. I really like these misters. They uh, there, you can take them apart, blow them out, clean them out. Uh, they seem to do a real nice job. I've got some on a propagating bed, uh, and I'll put a link to that video right about now. Uh, but uh, on a propagating bed, and uh, anyway, this is a, a simple. Once I got all my pieces together, all the components to this. It took about 15 minutes, 20 minutes. So, uh, if you don't want to go in your greenhouse all the time, watering, uh, this would be an easy, easy fix for you. Uh, not expensive. These are like a buck and a half a piece, two dollars a piece, something like that. And your hose and your fittings, you know, another, I don't know, not much, considering. Now, this is uh, this is my prototype greenhouse, and uh, so I made some mistakes on this, so you won't have to. I did uh, I did a piece of a cattle panel. This is more than eight foot long. I did a piece of a cattle panel, and I should have cut it and measured it better, but I didn't. But again, this is the prototype. This is the original. This is this is uh, greenhouse 10.01. Greenhouse 1.0. This is greenhouse 1.0. So. But anyway, I'll do this across here. I'll come across here. What I'll do on the back side, and there's my vent opener. And you can see it's about 55 outside right now, and you can see it's already starting to open. When it gets about 80 in here, which it is, <laughs> at least, uh, it starts to open. And uh, so anyway, I really recommend some kind of vent opener. Uh, but what I'll do is come across here. When I do the bottom, I'll come across the bottom, and then come. Uh, I'll elbow it right there come across here and then do a T and uh, I'll run me uh, depending on how many plants I have, have in here I'll run a misting system up and down both sets of shelves both sides of the greenhouse so I uh, really recommend unless you really love coming in watering plants with a sprayer a little pump up sprayer or something uh, this is just a cheap way to do it and uh, I'll put some links to the uh, below in the description to where you can get the misters and uh, the fittings and the pipe and all that. <clears throat> uh, also look at my, if you don't know anything about drip irrigation, 
our drip systems, our misting systems. Watch a video I just put up a few days ago uh, called, called Irrigation Watering. I'll put a link to it right now. And uh, anyway, it just explains real easily, uh, easy in instructions, uh, just exactly how to put together one of these systems or any kind of drip system. Drip is easy. Don't let it intimidate you. So. Getting watered nicely. <coughs> getting watered nicely. Uniformly, the leaves are getting misted. The stems are getting, you know, it's just standing. It's going to stay humid in here. You can also put a timer on it if you want to do that. I'm probably not going to do that now that I'm retired. I can come out here and do what I want to do. Leave it on for an hour or something and get plenty of uh, plenty of action here. Uh, these, one of the good thing about these misters, they will go up to, uh, you don't have to put a pressure reducer on them. They'll, uh, they'll handle like 50, 60 PSI, I think. So uh, that's one good thing about those. I, that's one reason I really like them. Most drip systems, you have to put uh, uh, some kind of pressure reducer on them. But these, again, come apart. They'll get stopped up on occasion. They'll just start dripping instead of misting. But uh, you just take them apart. And I just kind of either put a hose on it, uh, blow it out, or just kind of put my mouth on it and pull the, uh, it's hard to say suck, that just doesn't sound right, pull, <laughs> pull the, uh, the obstruction out of the misting head, but uh, I think these are, uh, these are uh, three quarters of a gallon an hour misters. Anyway, consider a misting system in your Texas Preppers greenhouse. We'll go. And I need to say also, whether you're going to make this into a greenhouse or a screen house or a, a chicken tractor, it makes a nice chicken tractor, um, you still might want the misting system. Uh, in, it depends on where you live, but in the summer times down here, uh, I put some misters on my chickens last year and they, they thanked me. <laughs> they actually came up to the house and thanked me. So anyway, you might want to consider it also if you're going to use it for a chicken tractor, also a misting system. All right.